Good morning. Today is November the 4th, 2019. And I would like to say I am thankful for having a job. A J O B. The word for the day is J O B. Thank you, John Witherspoon, for all your great commentary. You are an excellent comedian. Thank you for all the excellent movies you made and making us laugh. So our word for today is J O B. Job. A job. If you want anything in life, you're going to have to get a job. Unless you blessed with somebody that can provide you with everything that you want, you got to get a J-O-B. A J-O-B. The word of the day. If you want anything, if you striving for greatness, Go out and get it. Don't sit and wait for it to come to you. Don't sit and be miserable. There is some kind of job for everybody. Whether it's work from home, I do both. I have a little work from home job. I have work from home part-time, but I'm doing home health care and I have went back to one of my work from home jobs. I have. So I'm working two jobs. Then I Uber and drive Lyft, the third job. Then, I'm a licensed hair braider, professional hair braider. Not no penny any hair braider, a professional hair braider. So, I stay with a hustle. I always gotta have a hustle. My daddy said, if you get, if you got a skill in something, you can always eat. Maybe that's why I can't lose weight, because I got too many skills. So therefore, I stay a fluffy girl because I stays with a grind and a hustle, okay? I'm a certified swim coach, a certified Red Cross water safety so, Again, the word of the day is J-O-B. Whatever you are good at, get certified in it and make it a profession. I got a lot of professions, okay? So don't judge me. Again, I was raised that if you got a skill in something, you will never be hungry, okay? Neither will your family. So whatever your skill is, make it your profession. If your skill is YouTube and uploading videos and that's what you are good at, make it your profession, okay? If your skills is braiding hair, make it your profession. If your skill is building something, make it your profession. If your skill is doing DIYs, figure out how to make it your profession. Even if it's not your day job, you can still make it a profession where it can be providing a substantial income. If it's babysitting, babysitting is a high paying profession. You can go take classes, hop on your little cell phone there, Pull it out, boop, 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 and look up. Go to um, Red Cross, and they provide these babysitting classes where you can get, become a certified babysitter. Get you some first aid and CPR. Get you certificate. That way you can raise your prices in babysitting. And that what what happens? What what? It's now your profession because we pay a pretty penny for babysitting, baby, because we want our kids with the best. Make it your profession. You, you understand what I'm where I'm going here? If you clean house, if you clean house, make it your profession. Honey, get go down to the printer, print you a cute shirt, get you a little bucket together with all your professional stuff in there, have you some business card made, get you a little name to your business, make it your profession. So the word again for today is J-O-B. A lot of y'all have talents that y'all hiding behind. Stop hiding behind them. Own them. You good at what you do. If you full of ish 
and you like starting stuff, then you need to go out there and start you one of them gossip blogs. Make it your profession, okay? Maybe the word for the day, it needs to be a whole phrase, make it your profession. You hear what I'm going with this? Do not be out here suffering. Do not be out here hungry. Do not be out here not able to make your bills meet. All you need to do is own what you good at. I know people out here that's good at a bunch of things and they not cashing in on them. Stop hiding behind your stubbornness. Stop hiding behind, uh, I ain't gonna worry about it. Get off your arse and make it your profession. Stop wasting your God-given talents. Because y'all, I'm telling y'all, I have met some awesome creators that got other talents in their day life that they not claiming. Go on and get your coinage. Get your coinage. Because y'all are some awesome people. And y'all are some slayers, baby. Don't stop. Stop shortchanging yourself. Stop sitting up there and being like, no, uh, eh, no. Own it. Own it. People have talked about me, Gary, you got a certificate and everything. Hell yeah, I do. I sure do. And I when, when the bill need to be paid, I jump from one profession to another, honey. I throw on the next half of the next one. I, I'm out here like hustle man. Do -do 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 -do. Pick up the pieces. Do -do 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 -do. Pick up the pieces. Ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> Anyway, y'all have a blessed day, and I will see y'all again tomorrow for what I am thankful for, okay? So, I want y'all to leave here with a little bit of something. I want y'all to know that y'all all got your own profession, own hustle. God bless you all, and I'm finna go on to the job number one, and I'm gonna work two, three, four, and five later. I love y'all. Hugs and kisses. Lots of love always your girl, Nell. And remember, I love you all like a fat kid loves cake.